Knotball is really something amazing. Knotball is intellectual. Knotball is fun. Knotball is teamwork. Knotball is an educational experience. Knotball is great it's controlled chaos. Fun. It's really worth it. Fantastic. Knotball is dynamic. Exciting. Knotball is creative. Very cool. Knotball is awesome. Botball is an educational robotics program for middle and high school students which integrates computer programming, mathematics, and mechanical engineering into an interactive curriculum culminating in an autonomous robot competition. What makes Botball so unique is that it is a student-driven program. The teachers and mentors are there to guide, to answer and ask questions, and to make sure the students stay on schedule. But it's really all about the students. They build the robots, they program the robots, they create the website and documentation. They truly do all of the work. Another unique aspect of the Bopal program is that the robots are fully autonomous. There are no remote controls. Students use a C programming language to create their code that allows the robots to interact with the game environment without human intervention. It's all about programming. As, as you can see when you look at the machines, there's not a heavy emphasis on the mechanical side. We're building these machines out of Legos. But that's because what's happening is a lot of software development. We're building machines that are very, very smart Legos with a Botball program. I don't take computer programming or anything like that at school. I'm just learning all of that through robotics. It's amazing to watch these young people, some of whom have limited interactions with computers in their daily lives, learning an abstract programming language, applying it to a real world situation and getting results. Not only are they learning the basic syntax of one of the world's most popular programming languages, they're also learning some of the fundamentals of computer science and getting hands-on experience which they will carry with them for the rest of their lives. At the regional training workshop, teachers and mentors become students learning to build and program their own robot over the course of two days. While at the workshop, they become familiar with all the various sensors, actuators, and control systems which are included in that season's kit. They also learn the basic coding necessary to utilize these parts and create algorithms which introduce them to the C programming language. When the workshop is over, they take the kit and these new skills back to their students to pass on what they've learned and to inspire their students with their own tales of success. Now we know there are a lot of potential teachers and mentors out there who think, I can't do this, I don't know anything about electronics or computers or, or I'm not a science teacher, but in the Bop Ball program, that stuff doesn't matter. We train people with all sorts of different backgrounds and all different skill levels. Botball is working together with other people towards a common goal. I think the, the best part about Botball was really bonding with my teammates. Well, I'd say that Botball is a really great mix of creativity, teamwork, and caffeine. <laughs> it's just a great opportunity to meet new people and just learn more about science and physics and apply what you've learned in school to an actual practical application. Botball teaches the engineering process. It teaches students how to brainstorm. It teaches them how to prototype their ideas. It teaches students how to build and test and retest until they get it right. And because Botball is a time-limited program, it teaches the students to create and meet their engineering deadlines. Yeah, I, I view uh, Botball as a kind of engineering exercise before the real world while we're still in high school. It's sort of a complete engineering project because you've got the design, the development, the testing, the analysis of the problem, the, the completion, and then the scoring at the end, which you know whether you do good or not. From a science perspective, Botball gives the students the opportunity to learn the scientific process in a real-world endeavor. The very nature of the Botball Challenge means that students will need to develop ideas, test them, document the results, make changes, and test again. And we know as scientists and teachers that the best way to learn the process is by doing it. One of the most tangible benefits of the Botball experience is the receipt of the Botball Robotics Kit. Everything a team will need to complete the challenge. But the most amazing thing about the kit is, it stays in the classroom. It is intended to be a classroom resource which teachers and students can use and reuse for years to come. Many teachers have found uses for the kit in supplementing existing math and science curriculums and teaching technology and engineering courses. In some cases, Whole new courses have been created to take advantage of this amazingly comprehensive robotics engineering tool. Not only has the KISS Institute for Practical Robotics developed the Bopal Robotics Challenge, which culminates in several regional competitions each spring, 
but they've also created the National Conference on Educational Robotics, which occurs every summer and which brings participants in contact with many of the very brightest scientists and engineers in robotics and related fields. At the conference, students participate in workshops and classes designed to advance their understanding of robotics while also presenting their work in a professional environment. The National Conference on Educational Robotics gives kids the big picture of how this activity fits into the larger world. It gives them an opportunity to see what they can do later on in their careers. It gives them goals. They get a chance to see what adults are doing in the field. And it gives them the opportunity to see what other students from across the country are doing. Also, for any team that registers at the conference and wishes to participate, there is a national ball competition, which is similar to the previous spring's regional competition, where students get to try out new ideas, meet and compete with their friends from across the country. Southwest Comet is a rubber band powered grabber, incredibly fast, worn with a secret weapon. You don't know what it's going to do, but you'll see that it has an unusual design. <laughs> Computerish world. Bubble has uh, definitely steered my interest uh, towards robotics and confirmed that uh, it's something that I would definitely love to do. I learned a lot and like I'd do it again in a minute. Botball is the bridge in my experience for every child in middle and high school to academics and a real enthusiasm for education. I've expanded my vocabulary through Botball. Um, I've advanced my writing skills. I learn interactive C coding. Affects how I approach problems in terms of analyzing what is the problem first and then what's the most logical step that you can take to solve that problem. NASA and, and the Kiss Institute are joined together in a partnership to try to help the botball students really become the best that they can be. We're really interested in helping them not just become future NASA employees, some will, but a whole lot of them won't. They'll go on and do other things but we want to play whatever integral part we can in getting them started down a path towards a technical career. It allows them the freedom to be creative. It allows them to experience so many things that they wouldn't get in a regular classroom. On behalf of NASA, I'd like to thank Bob Paul for doing an extraordinary job in producing the most sound artificial intelligence challenge for young people today and for making the best and brightest available to NASA. Thank you, Bob Paul. <laughs>